Binondo. The oldest Chinatown in the world dates back to 1594 and to this day is a living, working district of Manila and also a fantastic food trip destination. So that's what I did. That's really, really good. I've wanted to do this Binondo food tour for quite a while and I haven't had the chance and now it seems like every week there's a new vlog from here so I'm back with Joey and some of his family are Filipino Chinese and have given us some tips on some little hidden spots that maybe haven't been featured in every other vlog that's made here. Let's see or maybe they're also everyone knows them I don't know. Welcome back. Yes, again, welcome back to Commander's Doubt Blog. Turn left on Tikkun Good day, all of you. Ah, Waze. Waze is telling us where to go. Our first stop today is behind the Binondo Church. A reminder that Binondo was formed by the Spanish as a place for Chinese immigrants who converted to Catholicism. I wonder what the speciality is here. Let's see. This is the silver silver roll bread. It's actually just a, like a piece of dough, no bread, but it's frozen. No. Afterwards, of course, we will eat it not frozen. Then what we'll do next is uh, we will be uh, um, steaming this one, like a shop house steaming it, then eventually frying it. So this is the silver roll, uh, silver roll bread. Uh, specialty of tasty, uh, is it tasty dumplings? <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. My my throwaway comment. I wonder what the speciality is. The speciality of tasty dumplings is not dumplings. Dumplings. <laughs> <laughs> but of course, afterwards, uh, yeah. it will be good with uh, hong ma. It's like uh, pumba. Hong ma, pork belly marinated in a soy sauce mix and cooked in peanut oil with shallots, spring onions, shiitake mushrooms, star anise and brown sugar, a real Filipino Chinese classic. Does it like this, like a tuna? <laughs> <laughs> like a tuna. <laughs> so we will start here. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's, it's hot. <laughs> it's hot. <laughs> it's crispy also, crispy. The, the skin is crispy because it's fried. It's steamed inside, outside it's uh, crispy like lechon. I don't know if I'm doing this right or not. Pork. Mm. The sourcing of that is so, so, so good. Really sweet, but not too much. And this bread smelt really good as it was being cut. This is a really, really good way to start. I love the flavor. Very good, I, li I like it. <clears throat> the sweetness, it's not so that sweet. This one, this one with this one. It really complement each other. Very, very good flavour. Good flavour, rich, not too much. The bread, really, really good. I need some more. I'm not a pork fat. I'm not a fat, I am a fat person. But I'm not a pork fat person. And the crispiness of this is, mm, it looks crispy, but it's tender and it tastes so much, so much flavour. The most flavour I've ever had in pork fat. This is a very good start to today, even if the name's a bit misleading. This place is Tasty Dumplings, but it does have dumplings, but we didn't try them. There's another place with dumplings where I'm actually going to eat dumplings. I've just seen this place. It's way too early right now, but I think at the end of the day, I'm gonna find space for that. Gotta check that out. I think this is good because the sign's still faded, which means they must have a good reputation. Oh, we're open takeout only. Okay. We can't dine in at Dong Bay, but instead, they'll make them fresh and cook them to order. And they're insistent that we come back when they're still hot. I'm gonna come back after 25 to 30 minutes, which then became 20 which then became 15, so. And such was their desire that we eat their dumplings hot. We didn't stray far, just to this nearby alleyway. Look at 
come into this alleyway looking for a place called Quick Snack. I had a quick look in Quick Snack and I don't think we'll be back in time to pick up the dumplings, which they insist we eat when they're really, really hot. So I'm gonna try this little lumpier place that I saw here. In case you didn't know what street this is, they tell you twice. We have the lumpia and I'm going back before I get scolded by some Chinese grandma. Yeah, where do we eat this? You didn't get scolded. That's yeah. the most important thing. Right, where are we gonna sit? I don't know. I can smell that river from there, from here. So not, not near that river. Um, I don't know, where are we gonna eat this? Let's have a look, let's have a look. We'll have a look somewhere. Well, that makes a lot better. <laughs> These guys have been very nice to let us eat here. Okay, so. It's probably incorrect. But these are Shao Long Bao. Shao Long Bao. Smell very good. With it is sauce, I think. Yeah, this sauce, I'm very afraid to open this with my teeth. To press it. You are a man of solutions. I wish you were there when I had my... Careful, it's my, it's my yep, I sprayed myself with it. Okay, there yeah. we go. If only you were here when I tried to eat coconut buko juice. That was um, not a very good attempt. This right here looks and smells very, very good. I'm gonna dip it in this sauce. Let's dip it in this sauce and snack. You can taste how fresh these are. I mean, I think they've just made these. These haven't come out of the freezer. These are really... They're hot on the inside. <laughs> I got a shock. That's the texture. Gonna texture. The texture's also very, very good. You're a food review expert, I think, Sir, Sir Joey. It's very exciting. Ah, okay. It's a giant lumpia. Can't even hold them correctly. Look at that. It's a beautiful, beautiful lumpia. Which I'm now destroying. Ah! There are some times you just need to go in with your hands. Put your clean. Sauce, yep, the sauce. I'm going to use the same sauce. I don't know if this is correct or not. Oh, yeah, I've used the wrong sauce. Okay. That's sour. Mm. It's good also with the same sauce. Mm. <laughs> That's it. That's really, really good. You taste all the vegetables. Wow. Just the flavors of this are. Wow. That's really, really incredibly good. I want to take another bite out of it. I have to cut it in two somehow because we're sharing the food. This is a sweet sauce. If you look at this, I've made a total, total mess of it. However, dip it, there we go. And catch it before it falls on the floor. You really taste the fresh vegetables. I don't know what it is, but it tastes like when I have roast dinner back home. That's what it tastes like. That's what it reminds me of. Roast dinner back home. Thank Again, you, thank for you, thank the you. family. Yes, thank you, thank the you family. so much. And the salad. doggy bear, the doggy yeah. boy. And they're also serving something at the window. Oh, giant lumpia. Different oh, style no, of them. Oh no, two one. Oh, that's two one. Ay, Nako. Two one and fries. Kamoti fries, I thought so. Kamoti sweet potato fries. This is awesome. I can't see it. I can't see a sign. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look for the sign outside. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Sai, sai sig. Ah, I see. Sig. I see what you did there. Henry C. The, 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 this one, the wrap, the wrap is so good. Of course, the taste of it. Then you again, you dip it here. Then you bite the whole thing. Mmm, God. <laughs> so good. You have a better eating face than me. wanted to try Wai Ying's roasted duck, but with a long line, we opted to continue down Benavidez Street instead. We're in Tondo. I don't know why I'm being dramatic. We're in Tondo, and there's apparently another Wai Ying. Wai Ying, I forgot what it's called. Whatever the last one I was at is called. There's another one down here. The secret branch. The Tondo branch. I like I see the I see that that is powder base. You just mix this one. You have the lemon. You have the. Oh. 
First of all, I thought that's coffee. Okay, this is the one fourth beaten duck, and this looks incredibly good and far too much for two of us. The one thing that us British and Chinese can agree about is that tea is life. There's lots of history between us about tea, which I won't repeat. There's no fork and spoon in, in sight. I have to embarrass myself using chopsticks again. Right. Duck. This piece, skin, sauce, dump it in the basin. <laughs> I just ate a big chunk. <laughs> Service chip. Hot, that's hot, that's hot. Mm. I hope so. If it's but, cold, there's a problem. Unfortunately, I have nothing to cut this up with, so that was a big bite. Very, very juicy. Juicy, it's really flavorful. The digestion. Don't get the bone. Huh? We found an artista. <laughs> a Filipino Chinese artista with us. To find, <laughs> to find more. Not really. But we, he's, he knows a lot of hidden spots here, so we're going to find some more. I'm really, really full. I think it's time for soup. Hey! 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 Hi! Hey! Hey! Nice to meet you! <laughs> Where's uh, becoming a Filipino? He's in, still in Mindanao. Ah, uh, Katil? Yeah, Katil, yeah. yeah. Yeah, 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 he's still there. I saw your video. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. And the farm, uh, fish pan. Yes, yes, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, That's really God. cool, huh? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice to meet you, huh? Bye. Yeah, yeah. Shout out to being my wife and uh, shout out to my son Jan and daughter Angel okay. and to all in Compostela uh, Bali. Thank you. Huh? Thank you. Thank you. Nice to meet you. What's your name? Roger. 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 Nice to meet you. you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Thank you. That's Thank awesome. You. Thank you. <laughs> oh. And I'm almost falling over. Wait, I forgot to ask. So we have Sir Joey and I forgot your name. Kerwin. Kerwin. So we have Joey and Kerwin. Kerwin the Artista. <laughs> We're going to go in search of something. Who knows what? I have energy again, thanks to the tea. I told you, as British and Chinese can agree on one thing, tea. Say, you want to be happy? Happy ending, happy ending. <laughs> massage, happy massage. It's a happy restaurant. Happy and our, our, our artista has already made banned jokes on YouTube. Actually, no, they're okay. They're okay, they're family friendly. If you don't know about it, like Disney. On Padilla Street is Ang Tunai which might look dated, but still has some of the most delicious food in Manila. Adidas. I just wish I came here earlier. I'm very happy we have three people to eat everything now rather than just two. So we're at, this, we're at the straight, uh, stage where the struggle is real, but we have more tea. There was no pigeon soup. They haven't done soup number five for years. So the slightly less exotic noodles and oyster cake. See, this is the oyster. Yeah. See that? Ah, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the oyster. Some ketchup and some hot sauce. That's very Filipino. Yeah. Same as pizza. I don't put ketchup on pizza. It's not something that's. It's not something that's ever appealed to me. <laughs> Hello, Italians. It's the dish man's coming. It's like an omelette with oyster. Very, very, very good. Very good, actually. Mm. Hey! To be honest, I like the fire truck. We've eaten a lot today, and 
I'm fairly hyper on lots of service tea at the moment. That's the Chinese way, it's also the British way. Definitely my way. There's a chocolate place I want to try because I saw it earlier and I'm definitely in the mood for maybe dessert. Nothing heavy again. And I was so excited for this. Ah, that's uh, so they make the pure tablia for like hot chocolate and champarado and so on. I could smell the chocolate through my face mask. It's powerful and it smells good. A slight disappointment at the end of the day in that I couldn't get dessert, but I'll live with it. I love the vibes of this area though. And that's always the most important. I feel good when I'm here. And I think you could keep exploring and keep finding new things and do your own tour. Thank you for driving me today, by the way. But I want to know, what's your favorite food of everything today? <laughs> First of all, you're welcome. Anytime, I can drive for you. Um, my favorite food would be a silver roll with the uh, hongma, the sweet uh, pork. I like. I also like the dumpling. The dumplings, yeah. The dumpling, right? The shaolong bin. Yeah. The dumpling, it's good. It has a good sauce. And also the lumpia. The lumpia. Yeah, the <laughs> you lumpia. like everything? <laughs> I think everything, everything, the oysters, I don't know. Mm. I think the, the, those three, those three. And yeah, the, yeah. the rest are just plainly even. Yeah. Yeah. Agent X44 in the building. <laughs> I like I like not, not having to drive around actually sometimes. <laughs> but um, actually my favourite, oh, the Hongma, the, the Hongma would be roll the roll. And I realised, I... Use the right three lanes to continue straight on 170, Taft Avenue South. Good to know. Um, <laughs> My favourite was that one because I kept eating it and I could have kept eating it and eating. The silver sp silver roll. I want to call it the silver spoon. I don't know why it's not the silver spoon, but I want to call it that. And, oh, the dumplings, yeah. Dumplings lump you, you know. I think there's probably lots more hidden stuff there. Just go for a wander, find some stuff. I went to Tondo. Yeah, I went to Tondo. That's not really an achievement, but I went to Tondo. And, yeah. More coming up. Tomorrow, next vlog, I'm going to Laguna. That's very, very exciting. See you next time.